When the GOP party tells you that their leader's election was stolen, you need to be woke. When Trump tells you that Biden is the most corrupt president in our history, for that, you need to be woke. When Trump lies about the treatment of migrant kids, you need to be woke. When Trump kept the media out of the treatment center to verify the condition, you need to be woke. When Jim Jordan suffered from temporary lapse of memory when he was at OU, you need to be woke. When Marjorie Taylor Greene declared that Jewish space laser was the cause of the California forest fire, you need to be woke. When Lauren Boebert photographed herself with an assault rifle that was two times too big for her, you need to be woke. When Matt Gates allegedly chose to wine and dine an underage girl, you need to be woke. When Trump tells America that he can get away with grabbing a woman by their profit part, you need to be woke. When DeSantis took on their mouth and eventually lost, it was because the mouse was more woke. When DeSantis took on their education system, it was because the education system was woke. Now, we are finding out that DeSantis have a taste for the young girl. How did we find out someone happened to be woke? The GOP party want to turn the word woke and make it into a bad word. The problem with the GOP party it's because they want all to stay asleep. Wake up everyone, democracy don't need a bunch of sleeping citizens. It will die if you don't wake up and protect her. Democracy is like a woman. Yes, a woman is sexy. Yes, a woman is strong. And yes, a woman is fragile physically. But like the GOP party, they underestimate the power of a woman and democracy. Who was Trump most afraid of? A woman. Who's the Congress afraid of? A squad of women. So GOP party, remember this. The first teacher in your life was your mother. Second was most likely a female teacher. And the third, the woman you wedded. Before I go, I kind of wonder what's the thought of the wife of the GOP party. Let's hear from them if they totally agree with their men controlling what a woman can do with her body. Now, with the Democratic Party growing some ball, we now have hope. Hope come from knowing that adults are finally becoming woke.